Being a kid in the 80s and early 90s was pretty awesome. We had a huge pop culture boom around every corner, and a lot of those shaped who we became as adults. From Saturday morning cartoons to Nintendo, action figures, collectible trading cards, and most importantly, movies. There was nothing quite like waking up in the middle of the night, sneaking downstairs to grab that secret stash of Oreos from the kitchen, and tiptoeing into the living room to catch the latest late night action flick on HBO. Action movies were kind of at their height at the time, and if you wanted to see them, you only had a few options back then. Either something was already on TV, or you could go down to the video store and see what you could find. Now, this was a traditional thing growing up in the 80s, and action was one of the most popular genres by far. You could always count on explosions, guns, heroes, villains, and of course, crazy fight scenes. At the time, martial arts was sort of just blowing up in action films, and it affected us all. From classics like Bloodsport to Big Trouble in Little China, we certainly got our fill of next-level fighting in movies. Now, I wouldn't be talking to you or doing this if it weren't for a phone call from a man named Jeff Langton. So, who's Jeff Langton? Well, he's a martial artist, stuntman, an actor who's been in tons of action flicks we watched growing up. But for those of us who are big fans of Van Damme movies, he's this guy. You're kind of pretty. I don't know if I want to fight you or fuck you. Ooh, Sonny! Oh, 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 oh. yes. As soon as he told me he was the guy in the movie Lionheart who says that classic line, I knew exactly who he was. So, originally, we set out to make a documentary about Jeff himself, but as we did, it grew into something bigger. And the deeper we dug, the more people started showing up. And these aren't just ordinary people. These are legendary world champion martial artists that not only have been well known for loads of action films throughout the 80s and the 90s, but they're also pioneers of their trade, changing the shape of martial arts as we know it. The more we talked to them, the more we realized how much love and camaraderie they have for Jeff and for each other. This is a story about world-renowned martial artists that graced the silver screen, gave us incredible fight scenes, introduced martial arts into pop culture, and how what we saw on that screen was only part of their story. <laughs>